What's up guys? Welcome back to the channel. I am of course CM Puma wherever you may be and however you may be watching. Thanks for making this video a part of your day. So here we are in the fifth week of March. We uh, talked with Grand Metallic about hey about uh, doing something for him. He says he thinks we can't submit somebody in our next match. So that's what we are going to do. Um, you know what? Before we do this, I've had a couple of the guys tell me to change my look. Look at Baron Corbin here. Hey, bro. Oh, cheesing. I've seen you in the ring and your work is intense. I am sure I'm not the only one that's seeing your talent. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise, especially your inner voice. Thanks, Baron. That was nice. All right. Um, let me... Uh, what? How? I can remove Kofi? Oh, I'm probably going to have to submit this dude. Okay. Well, first, let me uh, change some stuff up and see if uh, that helps us in any way. I don't know if it will. But let's do that real quick, and then we'll come okay, back. Okay, folks, we are back, and we've made some changes to CM Puma. We've changed his attire. We've changed um, a handful of his moves. So let's take a look at it right now and see what it looks like. Are you ready? Here we go. So right away from the back of the head, we can see that uh, the, the the mask is carbon fiber. Um, it's blue. We got a red, white, and blue armband. We got the Pat's Blue Ribbon logo there on the back of the helmet. The, the helmet. The back of the mask. So we slowly make our way around. We are red, white, and blue now in the mask. And that good old CM Puma face face mask stuff. let's see what old baron corbin has to say i got nothing to say to you keep walking so we have a um challenge by grand metallic to submit our next opponent and as you can see if we can get a little further out here uh maybe not puma's uh red white and blue he's got on a new day set of trunks um so we've got the Oh, we expect a lot out of you. Don't let us down. Win by submission. All right, let's go. So we will see um, all of Puma's attire and all that stuff. Oh, gosh, we're facing Chris Jericho. Look at that hell in a cell on a SmackDown. Good grief. Fatal 4-Way Ladder. Kevin Owens, Primo, John Cena, Fandango, Ty Dillinger, Big E, Triple Threat, Last Man Standing. This is like the most stacked... WWE SmackDown card ever. Tag team titles on the line. No holds barred. That's weird that this is a normal match. Last man standing. Triple threat. Fatal four-way ladder. Submission. Hell in a cell. What? All right, well, it is what it is. Let's get into our submission match with the Ayatollah of Rock and Rolla, Y2J. All right, folks, and to be straight up honest with you guys, I have tried this match over and over and over and over. I've probably played this particular match eight times. Getting a submission on Chris Jericho is damn near impossible. His submission stats are so high... And mine are so low that when he goes to do the submission, his little submission bar is so much bigger than mine that I don't have anywhere to go. And, and uh, submission after submission, Jericho ends up winning. And it's, um, it's, it's very difficult. And I don't know what happens if um, I continue the storyline. Um, but I must, I don't know if it will continue to make us do it over and over because I've, honestly I've been, um, I've been restarting the match. Every time I lose, I just do a rematch. And um, 
it, it's it's proving to be quite quite difficult. Get out of here. Bam! Four phenomenal forearm, huh? Um, so, I mean, all we can really do and all that I've been doing is trying to reverse his stupid signatures and finishers, which are the Lion Tamer and the Walls of Jericho. And then if that's not what he's doing... He is just putting us in like a bow and arrow hold, and criminy, it is hard to get out of. So, like I said, I'm just doing what I can do here to beat him down and try to hurt him as much as possible, and it just flat out doesn't seem to matter um, how damaged his body is. Right now, I'm getting it to red. I'm trying my very hardest to get him to gray and purple um it it just is n it just not working brothers and sisters it is not working so i don't know what we need to do i, I mean if do we need to um like quit and and Tried to see what happened. Good night. He just blasted us. Do we quit and see what happens? Do we not get the, um, uh, the, I don't even know what it's called now. I think Grand Met Metallic, Metallic, whatever, was a company man. So do we give up those points and move on? Do we just keep trying and get those points? I, so I'm I'm just at the point where I have no idea what to freaking do. Um, Jericho can you know not reverse moves all he wants, but in the end it doesn't matter because his his uh what am I trying to say his uh, submission stats are so high it's just nothing we can do about it. Um, and and at this point, I don't know where I'm at to try to get something like that done. Because like I said, it's incredibly hard. Sheesh. And the, mat, the match ends up being a damn good match. Um, you know, we, we end up getting almost five stars, which is freaking impossible. Um, but, you know, that is what it is. Throw him, throw him, do something. God dang. Um, so now his body is red. But, like I said, I gotta do something to get it to purple or gray. Um, as soon as he gets that signature and finisher, man, we are screwed. There's just nothing we can do. Um... And so right now, I'm trying to get him to use that reversal that he's got. Now he's got two. And as soon as he reverses, I was just going to say, as soon as he reverses, he's going to get a signature. So we're out of here. Um, dang. Well, he. there we go. He used it. Good. Damn. And that doesn't help. If he's got zero reversals and he's blasting us with moves left and right, he's going to throw us back in the ring, but... Oh, there we go. Nice. And... Oh. There we go. Get a move on him. We probably should have just done our finisher right then. Ah! Uh, neck breaker. Okay, he, he stepped out of it and good. Here's Puma's new finisher. We put him up on our shoulders. Toss up Puma Cutter. That's right. And we got to come back, so that's good. So what that means is we're going to get this full up and do this comeback and get our signature. Nope. Shit. This is where we go. This is what happens. Here we go. Here we go. And I got to just try to stay out of it. Oh, man. The problem is we have zero... 
to back us up on stamina. Look at our stamina down there. It's so freaking low that if I try to use my stamina to boost and get out of all this, um, it, it ends up not mattering because I can't. I run out of stamina. I just flat out run out of stamina. And it, it's uh, it's a little discouraging to having to do the same damn match over and over, but shit! Can we roll out? Can we roll out? Uh, I totally forgot he had the damn catch finisher. And this is what gets us. This damn bow and arrow has gotten us more times. Look how fast he's moving. And we're, we're out of it. We're out of it. Come on, get out of the ring, Puma. Jeez Louise. Oh, man. Another reversal. And we just get blasted over and over. And, and I'm like, this is like the most difficult thing that I've had to do in my career. Um, and it's not fun, man. I can tell you that. It is not fun to have to sit here and just get taken advantage of over and over and there's nothing we can do about it come on puma get up what, what are we doing what are we doing here and we're late on friggin everything working holds from chris jericho my gosh Get in the corner, you piece of garbage. And he reversed us anyway. And he's got a signature. Can we reverse it, though? No. Too fast. Okay. There's that. There's that. So we want him to use his last reversal. And he's not doing it. He's rolling out of the way. And we catch him. Oh, and we busted him open. Thank goodness. We, we've got done some damage to old Jericho here. And he uses a reversal. But in the end, it doesn't matter because he ends up having one left. So this is where this move comes in, this move stomp. If he can... If that can be reversed, then that works out fantastic for us. Uh, because we land on our feet regardless if we hit it or not. There we go. On our feet. No! We, we did it. We reversed him. And we are a five-star match, ladies and gentlemen. And that is yet to have happened. Let's see if we can try to submit him now. I mean, jeez Louise. See how low we are? And there's just, there's just nothing we can do. How are we supposed to beat this man? I don't know what the answer is. I have no idea what the answer is. And it is, it is quite, quite difficult. Not, I mean, we can't reverse anything here? Nothing? I mean, we can't, we can't do anything. So even when he doesn't have a signature or finisher, he ends up doing this bow and arrow thing, and it screws us over every single time. And he just slaps us in the face. God dang it! And here we go. This is how it ends. No, oh, thank goodness. He's got a signature though, and we we're too late. This is how it ends. Over and over and over. Can we crawl? Thank God. Thank the good Lord, but it doesn't matter. Son of a B. It doesn't freaking matter. Come on. Let go. And we're gonna we're gonna get out. Oh my! Oh my! What a frustrating situation this whole friggin' thing is. And I, like I'm saying, I just, I don't know what to do. I don't know where we're at. How do we beat him? 
how do we beat Chris Jericho in a submissions match when our submissions are incredibly ineffective and his are incredibly effective? I just, I've been at this same match over and over again for a good hour. And there's just, oh God. Here we go. Too late. We get hit with a code breaker. Can we roll out? Oh my gosh. Get off of me. Thank the good Lord, baby Jesus. Nothing he can do now. He can't stop us. From doing any moves. Woo! But that doesn't mean it's gonna matter. Now he's purple. Now he's purple. Can we just get him up and put it try to put an end to this? I don't know how. But Lord baby Jesus, give us the strength. Literally give us the strength. This leg could be over for Chris Jericho. A truly punishing oh man stretch. oh man no shit see no, it's not nothing well, I cannot do a single tackle. frigging thing He's pressing all the right buttons down. And not a single thing can be done the unfortunate reality is I mean his body is purple which wouldn't shock me one bit talk about a beating he's taken here tonight I mean can we can we try to break his back? We're at five stars. This has been the most difficult and intense matchup we have ever done. And I can't get a submission in edgewise. Uh-oh. Oh, boy. He is too good. He's too fast. And I use up every bit of stamina I have in trying to do so. Things definitely aren't looking very good for him right now. He misses the mark. He might need glasses. My this gosh. Is clearly compromised. When this guy's on, I mean, and there's the elbow. Swing come on, Jericho. Strike one, two, Do the job, man. Do the job. His body is gray, and it doesn't matter. He reverses us. By Chris Jericho. Too fast. Get off. He's still got that signature, though, and that's scary. That is scary business. Come on. He, he, he moved. Oh, man, we reversed it. Thank goodness. What, what is our... Well, I mean, it's an, a damn arm move. But it doesn't matter because we're not, we haven't worked his friggin' arms. Get up. And we're completely out of stamina again. Oh, shit. I'll take a power bomb right now. And he's got a signature. We've got a, we got a reversal up. I mean, can we, can we reverse his signature? No. We're done. This is it. I mean, I, I don't know. Come on. Thank God. Can we roll out? But he's got a finisher. And whatever this move is that apparently is irreversible. And now we're done. Because I don't have enough stamina to stay out of it. Apparently I do. Apparently I do. Man, oh man, oh man. Oh, you piece of garbage. You freaking waste. And now he's going to reverse us and somehow not use a reversal stock. Ugh. Come on. Can we get a rope break? And now I'm done. I'm out of stamina. Nothing I can freaking do. I'm so pissed. All right. Uh, we're going to skip. We're just going to keep going. And I don't know what's going to happen. If we have to win this match, I don't know what to do.
All right, we're not even going to talk to... I don't want to talk to you. Well, I don't want to say that it'd be easy, but it definitely did not go the way it w that I wanted. It just got him in the positions. That's the tricky part with submissions. You have to work hard to hold to get the hold line. No kidding, Akira. No kidding. I'm leaving. This sucks, man. That was freaking awful. That was terrible. I'm not talking to him. That was freaking terrible. I tried for a solid hour to try and get that done. And the and the, the, the other issue is I can't I can't um, change my attributes without any freaking attribute points. So if I want to change my freaking submissions, I don't have any attribute points to do so. I've got 3,000 VC and no attribute points, so I can't do friggin' anything. Guys, this episode, this episode has sent me off the freaking rails. Off the rails. Give me my car, man. I'm ready to get out of here and go drink some beer. Well, I th oh, Superstar Shake-Up. All right, well, the Epicos and... Bobby Roode go to Raw, and SmackDown gets Heath Slater, Rhino, and Cassius Ono. How is that? Uh, okay. Triple H, what, what's up, man? Glad I caught you while I was here. I didn't think you wanted to see me. What can I say? Power shifts quickly in the business. You had a busy last month, and I started asking myself questions. Well, good. The freaking clinic Chris Jericho just put on CM Puma was insanity. Yeah, you probably did misjudge me. You probably should have paid more attention. It's pretty simple, you know. CM Puma is a force to be reckoned with. Chris Jericho found that out after it took him a bunch of times to submit me instead of forcing me to decide on things on my own. In fact, I was. I kept an eye on you. Well, good, Triple H. I'm, I'm very happy. But things happen, and my attention was needed elsewhere. I think we can make up for lost time. Remains to be seen, but if you're going to throw something awesome my way, I will take it. Company man all the way, Triple H. You know that. You know that. Look at this dude. He is so happy to be here. I'm going to punch him in his face. Outlaw. Heard Mr. McMahon was going to be in the building next week. Well, you know, you probably heard right. There's Daniel Bryan. I'm not talking to Daniel Bryan. I'm talking to Shane O'Mac. Because I'm a company man. Spectacular timing. It's good of you to drop by before the show. Sure thing. I really wanted to chat. Lately, I felt like you don't have clear enough visibility. Are you freaking kidding me, Shane? Triple H is telling me something here. He sees it too, huh? First of all, don't worry. I think I have a way to get you out of this before it becomes a rut. How about no more freaking submission matches? That would be fantastic. So many great eras begin with powerful duos. Are we about to be a tag team? Audience sees up kind of right. Sean and Triple H started DX. NWO started as a duo. Kane and Daniel Bryan, KO and Jericho, I could drone on, but you get the picture. Yeah, I do get it, but if you're going to pair me up with Tazawa or or freaking Outlaw out there in the hallway, I'm going to punch you in the face. Then I think you know where you're going with this. I think you have to recruit, recruit a top superstar and create a new duo for a new generation. I can definitely roll with this. Thanks for the advice. I know you can handle it. Looking forward to see the results. All right, well, I'm going to leave this to the next episode. Um, which will be later in the day, of course. But man, I'm out. I'm about had it. All right, well, we got to go speak with Todd, but I'm going to not. If you can't, if you can't tell, guys, I am like heated. And it's just, it's just too much. That damn submission match. And honestly, I should have just skipped it and gone on with my day. Um, and finished this video a long time ago. But I wanted to win. I wanted to get that victory and get that company man status up. Who's down here? Him. We got Gary Coleman. Man, I need I need some thank you. I need some uh some positivity sent my way. I appreciate that, Gary. Alright, well that's gonna be it for this episode. We're definitely not teaming up with Dolph Ziggler, that's for sure. Um, if Randy Orton's out there, we will team up with the Legend Killer, but 
Um, in the next one, we'll talk to Todd, and we will see uh, what we can get going here. And uh, I guess I need a new T-shirt. Man, that sucks. VC is another thing. I'm heated right now. I will freak out about any little thing. So that's going to be it, guys. Uh, thank you for watching this video. Please leave a like if you enjoyed it, of course. Subscribe if you're not. Oh, man. We're going to talk to Todd and maybe get a tag team partner. We'll figure it out. I'll see you soon.